Hello everybody, this is your boy Ju Jeezy and I am back with another Power Ranger Lightning Collection video. I, you can tell it's been a while since I said that because I've been doing one six scale reviews, but today I am talking about the Lightning Collection. Today I have SPD A Squad Pink Ranger. And man, I must say it looks good inside of this box, man. Yes, the Pink Ranger is a guy is a girl. It's not like the yellow one. If you tune into my last video, you know the yellow one is a is a guy, it's not a girl. So SPD A Squad Pink is a girl. But nevertheless, you know, Hasbro, shout out to them with the artwork box for the for the Lightning Collection. They always do great on the Lightning Collection artwork. On the boxes, you got the SPD sign at the top, got the SPD A Squad Pink Ranger helmet on the side coming around to the front. And as you see it toward the front, you got the SPD Pink Ranger inside of the box. You guys aren't finna take the thing out of the box. I ain't finna be talking y'all all day long. You got the SPD A Squad Pink on the side with the Lightning Collection emblem down there at the bottom. Man, but enough about that, man. I'm gonna take this thing out of the box. Show the accessories, man, and see, let you guys see the what this Ranger looks like outside of the box, man. So you guys stay tuned and uh, just enjoy the show, man. Stay tuned. All right, you guys, you can see I've taken the figure. Well, you can't see, but I've taken the figure out the box and I've taken all the accessories out the box. So first, we're going to talk about, you already know, these flimsy hands. Now, of course, the women's hands are definitely smaller than the men's hands. And they gave her a wrist chop. Of course, that's for posable posable stances and then a close fist once again for posable stances i don't plan on using either one of these they're going to go in the box with the rest of the posable hands so don't forget that then of course you have the lightning collection once again they're recycling the same lightning collection the only thing they finally did right was make it the same color as the ranger so i give them kudos to that i guess um that's about it for this just a basic lightning collection uh accessory just makes it look like they're shooting a blast out of the gun and then, of course, with the A Squad, like I said in my last video, and the Blue Ranger, if you haven't seen, you know, watched that one in a while, the A Squad Blue, and that two pack that I did a video on, so make sure you check that out. Um, they got the same rifle, same with the same Doggy Kruger, Doggy Kruger emblem on the sides here, and it is pink. Let you know it is the Pink Ranger's rifle gun as well. Um, so that's pretty much all I can really say about that. There's really no functionality in this thing, it doesn't come apart, doesn't move, it's just a rifle. So um, there's really nothing to really talk about when it comes to this. It's just there, you know, for the most part. It's, it's pretty good. Like I say, I like the way it looks. I'm glad to refocus. I like the way it looks for the most part. Uh, but there's nothing really to talk about when it comes to uh, the accessories. They're just lightning collection accessories. You know, it's 20 So, I mean, what do you guys expect? To be a one six scale, whether it's accessories or off the chain, extra detail? No, it's a $20 figure. You're going to get 20 worth of accessories but enough about that i'm going to show you guys what the pink ranger a squad looks like um give you a review on it give you what i've been up to what i'm going to be up to man and um that's about it so you guys stay tuned all right you guys now i have spd pink finger out on the turntable um first impressions out of the box i must say it looks good it's a female character so of course you know they're a little bit smaller um, I think then the male figures, um, by the way, they use the mold in the Lightning Collection. Same thing with the one six scale. The female characters are the same size. The male characters are bigger. Um, but nevertheless, uh, once again, I must say, uh, I like it. You know what I'm saying? I'm not going to complain. This is like an A-Squad figure. So, can't really trip about that. I'm going to get this thing, pull it closer to the camera. Um, you guys can see it does have the 90 degree bend in the elbow. It does not have double jointed because all the girls do not double jointed. Now, on the side note, my other arm does not bend too well. So I've heard about putting heat on it to try to get it to, to bend. This is why I tell you guys when you get these figures to take them out the box and look for any imperfections, um, break them in because uh, they're going to be sitting in your closet for a while unless you plan on playing with them, <laughs> you know, so et cetera, et cetera. But um, make sure you... Um, Check them out, see if I have any uh, imperfections, which mine does. I cannot bend this arm up too hard, so I'm not going to break it, so I didn't do it at all. Of course, you got the double jointed in the knees, so that all the characters do have the double joint in the knees, which is pretty dope. You do have the, the swivel back and forth when it comes to the ankle. Uh, it goes up and down. It, doesn't, it does not go side to side. Um, also, you do have the thigh turn here, so it does turn, but like I said, you got a breaking edge. You can tell you probably heard that sound. It's a little stiff. Same thing goes to this leg here. You turn it like this. To be honest, guys, I just opened this thing today. I thought I opened this uh, when I first got it, but I guess I didn't. Of course, you got the Pink Ranger helmet here. Um, it does do a full 360 spin, as you guys can see, back and forth. Once again, um, all these A-Squad characters do have human heads, according to the show. 
Uh, they did not make any human heads for the Lightning Collection like they did the good guys. They did not do the bad guys like that. I'm hoping that they do a, a justice and probably send us um, human heads for all the figures because they all have human heads. Um, it does have the same baseball vest. That's what I'm going to call it, guys. It could be wrong. Don't butcher me. Uh, baseball vest. Sue does have the Lost in Space helmet with this extra attachment to not make like Lost in Space. Uh, I think it was just another way for them being cheap. That's just my opinion. Um, but overall, it is what it is. It does have the uh, plastic mold for the SPD here. So, it is what it is. Got the SPD banner on the side. Got the A here in the shoulder pads. <laughs> it's funny because B Squad don't have any of that. They just got the numbers. It doesn't say B on there or anything like that, which is crazy. Um, but I'm going to put this back on the turnstile. If it'll stand in one piece for me. All right, come on. Okay, so she wants to give me the flux. Hold on. There we go. All right, so she's on there. All right, so my rating for this um, SPD Pink Squad A. I'm giving it an eight. I got an imperfection in the arm. I can't bend it, which sucks. Um, so I don't like that. But once again, it's a torn out of figure. So what else you want me to do other than complain about that a little bit? But that's why it's called a review. Because we review these things on purpose. So shout out to all my collectible channels, all my collectors out there. Man, shout out to you guys because you guys know what I'm going through. You know, us being collectors, we like to have stuff perfect, even though it's not going to be perfect. But we still want to try to make sure it's perfect as possible. But nevertheless, 8 out of 10 on this SPD A Squad Pink. I do like it. I do can't wait to get the rest of the team. Um, and I can show you SPD um, A Squad, SPD Blue Squad, I mean SPD B Squad side by side. The only one I think I'm missing from SPD B Squad is the yellow. Um, the one I'm missing, the only two I'm missing from my A Squad is red and green. So I got to get those two. And I think they're on Hasbro Pulse. I just need to order them and get them. And then uh, I can get it. They've been out of stock for a while. So that's probably the reason why I haven't gotten them. But I'm going to get them nonetheless. Um, but you guys know I'll talk about all my YouTube inspirations. The South of Tall Guy Car Reviews, which is going to be changed soon. Jasmine Love, Mr. Organic, CJ on 32s, Life with Corey, BJ on 30 Shoes, um, Hemi Life, um, man, Real to Real, I mean, Hellcat, the, man, I just watch so many people on YouTube, because I don't watch regular TV, guys, I watch, it's YouTube, because YouTube is TV, actually, so, regular TV has nothing on it to me, personally, other than WWE during the week, and love show about watching the week, but other than that, I'm watching YouTube, I'm playing my PS5, um, or working, Lord knows I'm doing that, um, but that's about the end of this video, you guys, I really don't have too much to say, um, I got some stuff coming in the works down the line, I got more one six scale Rangers, Coming soon, I have more Power Ranger Lightning Collection rings coming soon. I have Marvel characters. I have Rolling Warrior characters. Uh, I give y'all some extra little jibbles. I wasn't supposed to, but I gave y'all that hint. I'm not giving y'all anything else, though. Uh, but shout out to my new subscribers who are watching this video for the first time. If you like what you see, if you guys or like anything that you see, please subscribe to the channel. You know, hit that bell for all post notifications. Leave a thumbs up. Leave a comment. I greatly appreciate it. And you guys, if you do subscribe, welcome to the family. I greatly appreciate it. To my current subscribers who are part of the, the family. I haven't thought of a nickname for the family for the channel yet. So give me a second, guys. I'm still trying to figure that out. Something that rhymes pretty cool. But thank you guys for my current subscribers who have been watching me since day one. I greatly appreciate it. To all my friends, all my family, to everybody overseas, everybody around the world who watches my channel. Uh, thank you guys so much for supporting. Make sure you hit that thumbs up. <clears throat> Make sure you... Hit the um, you leave a comment and make sure that you share my channel. No matter who it is, just share it if you can, you guys. That goes along with whether it's on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, whatever. Please share it. I really even TikTok share it. I really appreciate it, you guys. Thank you so much for all the love and support. I, it goes a long way, and I really appreciate it. I do read all my comments, whether they're good or bad. I read them and I do respond to them. So thank you guys so much. Uh, I want to give a shout out to 76 aka 3 the hard way they have rebranded and they have a great podcast you guys check that out especially for the women who are looking for like empowerment and stuff like that or if you got some things going on you I never know what you guys have going on in your life but they talk about everything so please check out their podcast 76 aka Pandora's box aka 3 the hard way check them out them three black women they're doing great things you guys watch them they're great um once again, that's all I have, you guys. Thank you so much for watching the video. You guys know my slogan. It goes a little something like this. This is your boy, Juju Jeezy. Competition is always easy. You guys be safe. You guys be blessed. Until next time, you guys, I am out.
Thank you.